Today we're talking all about great gifts for RVers. I like gifts. Yeah, it's coming up <laughs> to the holiday season, so these are gifts that you give people for the holidays, but these are gifts that you give anybody any time of year. These are all great gifts for Correct. RVers. And yeah. all or under a hundred bucks. That's right. And we will leave a link in the description mm -hmm. to all of these products so that if you want to go check them out, just go down in the description, click on the link, and you can go look at all of the intricate details that we're probably leaving out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So the first thing we're going to talk about is this really cool gift, and it's it's so versatile. Yeah. We use it all the time. Okay. It's a weather radio. Yes. And I think every RVer probably needs some kind of weather radio just yes. because. And ours is not a glorified weather radio. No, it's it very basic. It doesn't have fancy stuff. But it's got a lot of cool features. It does have a lot of cool features, but yeah. I wasn't willing to spend a lot of money. No, on the weather radio. we just wanted to get the job done. You know, yeah. if we're in extreme weather, we lose power. We want to be informed. We want to know when to take shelter and all that, all that good stuff. Yes, yeah, so if somebody would have just got it for us, I'd have been thrilled. Yeah, it's a good, yeah. it's a good gift. So this thing has AM, FM, mm -hmm. and weather band. Yes. Seven weather band channels, yes. so that you can tune in to your local weather, and they're telling you when to get away from the tornado, or when yeah. to get to shelter, or mm -hmm. when to bug out, or whatever. Yeah. And it's good because even if your power is out, and even if you forgot to charge this thing, yes, it still works because you can hand crank it. Hand crank. <laughs> I love that. Very cool. You can. There's a bunch of different ways to to power it. It yeah. has solar power. Yep. Plug in battery, okay. and we already talked about the hand crank. crank. Yep. Two flashlights on this bad boy. Yes. It's not got one, the, but like two. The, the big reading yeah. one that clips up, and then the regular flashlight. That, and it's got this SOS alarm. So if yes. something happens, you never know. You're in the storm. You're find me. RV gets blown away. You still got your weather radio. You can click the SOS button. It'll flash red and an audible alert that let people know where you're at. And, and so you can charge cool. devices. Yeah, the power bank, which yes. is very cool. So here's the coolest part about the whole thing, because in conjunction with the power bank and the hand crank, so let's say your power goes out and you don't have any of your other power banks charged mm -hmm. up, your phone's getting ready to die, you can charge your phone. I'm by hand cranking it, it. Yeah. so you never have to worry about not having power <laughs> for your correct. phone. But you have to choose whether it is that important to use your phone. Yeah. Are you willing to hand crank to use your phone? <laughs> Most people are. We are. <laughs> Let's face it, we are. Alright, what's the next gift? Okay. It's actually one of my favorite gifts. Um, strange. <laughs> We're going to say that on every gift. It is. <laughs> this it is one of our favorite ones. <laughs> it is one of my favorite gifts. It's, it's the document bag. File document bag. Yeah, but it's not just a document bag. No, but it's it's fire retardant for up to 2,000 degrees. Are you laughing because I said retardant? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I thought you were going to say resistant. You said retardant and I couldn't hold it. <laughs> it's also water resistant. Mm -hmm. It is lightweight, mm -hmm. which is why we have it now over the last safe we had. Last safe was super heavy. Super heavy, bulky. Yeah. And I love it's lockable. Yeah. And it's an, a, a filer. So it's got different sections. It's got pockets. It's got zippered sections for passports yep. and stuff. But then it's got seven accordion files because I'm an organizer. So yeah. I can put different documents in each one and tab them and easy to find. Our last one, I'd have to take everything out of yeah. the the it safe just to go through it and find the paperwork I'm looking for. All right, the next thing is, I mean, it's pretty common. So, uh, you know, we didn't know whether to include this because it's not really that unique, but we love our camp chairs. We do love our camp We've gone through a lot of camp chairs. We have, and these have been our favorite by a lot. Mm -hmm. And for a couple reasons. Yes. They're light. Very light. They fold up really small. They don't have the bag. You're not a fan of bags. I don't want to put the thing in the bag, man. <laughs> You're like wrestling a gator trying yeah, to get it. Yeah, so this thing, I mean, it has the little <laughs> cup holder, has a little cell phone, cell phone holder, holder. And then you could just boom right up. And it's a hydraulic rocking. Yeah, so it rocks. You get a little we movement like going on. And it comes in a, a low profile and a higher sitting yeah. version. We have the lower ones because yeah. I'm short legged. So. Yeah, high profiles are a little <laughs> more expensive, but I think the high profiles do come in a bag. They do come in a bag. Low profiles, I like them because they just fold up and it's got a little built on strap hook. Yeah, and you just carry, we carry thing. it to the next campsite. And you can just toss them right in the yes. thing. Or take if we're going to a friend's house, space. just throw it over your shoulder, walk over to their campsite. Pow. We take them down when we go fishing, everything. Yeah, very convenient. Love our chairs. And like the rocking. I do like the rock. 
I always have to be in motion. I have to be yeah. moving. <laughs> I want to rock! <laughs> so the next gift we're talking about is this New Wave cooktop uh, induction cooktop. So you can cook with plate. Any yeah. kind of any kind of pots or pans will work on this. Exactly. Yeah. And it doesn't take up a lot of space. If you no, don't want to no. use your propane, yeah. or if you've got a lot going on, you can use it as an extra burner. Exactly. If you've yeah. got a lot going on in the stove and you still need boil something, yeah. it's a great... I love because, one, yes, it saves us on propane. Don't use the stove as much. I love... Every, it's so digital. It's not just low, medium, high, like mm -hmm. a burner, you know, would be. You can actually digitally control the temp. Yeah. You can pick low, medium, high, or it even has settings for medium high, medium, low, so yeah. you can get a balance, but I like that you can actually set a temp if you need it to. And not only that, you can control how many watts you're using. Yes. So depending on where you're at, so this is perfect for RVs or apartments or houses or anywhere that you're at, you can set the, that watt you did usage mm -hmm. so that you're not using up too much power. Exactly. Too. It's got what? Uh, 600, a 600 setting, a 900 setting, and a 1300 yeah. setting. Yeah. It's wonderful. I love it. And what? it cools real easily. It's fast. really safe. So yeah. once it's done, I can put it back in the cabinet and be done. Yeah, even if you're gonna, even if you can touch this thing, you're not gonna burn yourself. Yes. So it's exactly. super, super safe. If the kids accidentally grab a hold of it, Pets, it's not gonna burn them. Knock it down. Yeah. Whatever. You boil water with this thing two times faster That's than right. a traditional cooktop. Yeah. So if you're just doing like a pasta, why not use this instead of using your, you yeah. know, propane because it's gonna take a lot longer, longer to do that. And yeah. yeah, and and I can use it anywhere. I can take it outside on a folding table if we're cooking outside stuff, and yeah. I want to do a side. I can do it right here on the island. It doesn't have to be over at the stove. The last gift we're going to talk about is the Mopika propane sensor. It's one of your favorite things. I love it. You do love it. Because I don't have to worry about how much propane I got. I know yeah. exactly how much propane I got. And I don't even have to get up off the couch. Yeah, that's, it that's why you like it. <laughs> yeah. And it's way more accurate than those little gauges that, that you get like from Home Depot or Lowe's or wherever. Yeah, and put them on your valve. Because this thing uses sonar. Yeah. It comes with two sensors and a monitor. So you take one sensor on each one of the bottom mm -hmm. of your propane tanks you plug it up there it, it sticks with a magnet yeah you program it onto the app and it tells you exactly how much propane you got yeah and it does come with another monitor too that you can like mount somewhere in your rv so yeah if you don't we have it use... in our coat closet and you can just go in yeah. there and press the button and see how full you are yeah so if you don't want to use the app or if i'm not around my phone or yeah. she wants to check it she can just go look at that yeah. and it's easy so it, it lets us know because it always seems that you run out of propane in the middle of the night or when it's most inconvenient time possible, yeah. that's when you're out of propane. Yes. At least it is for us. Yeah. We have done it at both cooking time <laughs> and cold winter night. Yeah. <laughs> like trying to cook dinner. Guess what? We're out of propane. Yeah. Or you wake up in the middle of the night freezing. Yeah. Like I see dead people cold in there. It was, <laughs> yeah. It was terrible. So now we have Mopika. <laughs> it's a good price. And under 100 bucks. Exactly. So it's good. Well, that's it. That's our five gifts for RVers. Now, yeah. there's way more gifts than that, but oh, these well, yeah. are just five that we picked out that we think will be good gifts for people. If, if somebody showed up and gave me one of these, I would be thrilled. Yeah. Well, not thrilled. really because we already have them. But Well, I mean, if I didn't have them, <laughs> I would like to get these things. Yeah. So if you have an RVer on your list or if you are RVers and you want to buy gifts for each other, these yeah. are good things that you can give inexpensive or if you're doing like an rv secret santa kind of th gift thing exchange. This yeah good gifts to great give. gift option yeah but hey stick around for a few seconds we're going to honor a fallen service mm -hmm. member if you want to get involved with helping us help vets out on the road everything you need to know is down in the description of the video we appreciate you watching mm -hmm. see you next time bye, bye.